Hey, this is Peggy with Easy Peasy Machine Embroidery, and I am in the Premiere Plus 2 Ultra software, and I am in the Create module for a second or two. Um, I want to show you something I learned a long time ago. Um, I was working with a red work, um, or I created a design in the Create, and then I wanted to add a uh, pre-made embroidery on top of it and when I went to stitch it out it the background sewed in the entirety it did not leave a space for the um, object that I wanted to insert and I didn't want that base to show through my top object so let me show you this is a design that I made in the create module I made the heart base and then I wanted to insert a another picture on top so as to make a small pin. So the first thing I'm going to do so you can see this a little bit better is take that white color and turn it another color. I'll just make it this color for now. Oops better do another choice anyway that's not doing what I want it to do so we'll just continue on here I want you to go into the design player and we're going to pl play this out and see how it stitches out. And basically what's going to happen is those designs are all going to stitch out in the entirety, not leaving any space for my inserted design. So, sometimes that design would show through underneath. And if it doesn't, at the very um, least, it's going to be very dense because you've got one design stitching over another one. So I learned a long time ago that you design the background and export it, and then you design the um, embroidery itself, the, the dog itself I created as a separate design, exported both, and then I brought them both into my um, Premiere Plus Ultra regular embroidery software, one on top of the other. Remember, you can change the layout order. I have them grouped, but you can change the layout order so the back um, stitches first or the front stitches first, things like that. Anyway, if you go and look at this in the design player, as it stitches out, see how it's left a hole for the dog. So that when it stitches out the dog, that dog is not going to be stitching over other designs and be really dense or have the design show through underneath. Okay, so that's how I fixed the problem with that. I had originally done a red work and the red work was showing through underneath the dog as I stitched it out and that I did not want so that's how I solved that problem. I'll show you the design that I was working with that I had that problem with. These are all the designs I have done through the years. Here's a design that had that kind of an issue. And now I'm hoping and praying that that design is there. Dum diddy dum.
And here is the design. And basically, there were lines showing through the terrier at this point. And that red really showed through the white. So that's how I um, fixed that problem. I did the des uh, I had the design in uh, Create, and I put some of the stuff in here. Um, but then I had to do the dog separately in the regular embroidery module. Anyway, that's just how I did it.